since we finished our ice cream art project, we're going to make ice cream in a bag now. And what we, you will need is a half a cup of half and half, one tablespoon of sugar, one fourth teaspoon of vanilla, one Ziploc bag, but we're actually going to use two just in case one gets a hole or something, a bigger gallon Ziploc bag to put the small one inside, and that bag will be filled with crushed ice, and you can use rock salt or we're going to use sea salt today. So the first thing the girls are going to do is put everything into their small bags. Lauren's going to put one tablespoon of sugar in with her half and half. And now Lauren's going to put in one fourth teaspoon of vanilla and she's going to close up her Ziploc bag now. And then just mix it a little bit and set it still while we get the ice. Alright, so the girls are ready. Both of their bags have the ingredients inside. I, I made sure that the bags were sealed tight. I would suggest that. And then I put it inside another Ziploc bag. The big bags have ice in them, and the girls are going to put sea salt on top of the ice right now. So Lauren, why don't you dump some sea salt onto the ice? This helps keep the ice colder for longer. Enough. That should be enough. Lauren, Peyton, go ahead and put some on yours. And then Lauren, you're going to put your, Lauren, Peyton can do it. Nice job helping her sissy. Keep going. Oh. Okay girls, now you're going to put your small bag inside the big bag. Because now we have to get our ingredients to freeze. You know, zip up the big bag. And then you're going to start shaking it around. So now the girls are shaking their ingredients and making their ice cream. And in about 10 minutes, it should be frozen and ready to eat. One, two, three, four. four and here are the girls eating their finished product of ice cream in a bag. How is it, girls? Amazing. Amazing? Peyton, what do you think? How is it? I'm clumsy. It's scrumptious, huh? Mm -hmm. And as you can see, we also added chocolate chips and sprinkles. Enjoy, girls.